All right, everybody, we are back with Oregon Trail. We're only a couple legs away from maybe getting all the way to where we're uh, shooting for. So we're gonna go ahead and leave here. We've got 328 miles to the mines. Uh, we just left Las Vegas. Oh, we got a tombstone. Uh, let's investigate it. Let's check out what it says. Here lies Rich and Angie Sutton. Nom, nom, nom. Oh, I found a, net, a med, med kit. That's nice. I think that's the first time we've found something from a grave besides a zombie head and sticking out. You don't notice the speed bump in the road. Everyone hits their head as you fly over. Oh, I think that may have actually hurt some of us a little bit. You aren't sure which way to go? You lose an hour bickering with Ryla. Sounds feasible. I wouldn't doubt that that would happen. We still have uh, most of our people in our car. Achman unfortunately died a couple seasons back. Ryla is now making small talk, probably bickering with the other people in the car. Something catches your eye off the road. Would you like to go investigate? I certainly would. Anything to make this interesting. You approach a lively looking building. Out front is a band of survivors who look particularly healthy considering their circumstances. One of them rises from, this, from the stew he was tending to and comes to greet you. Hello there, friend. It's good to see you, such a fine looking bunch of folks out in this neck of the woods. Greet the stranger. You extend your hand for hand, or stranger for the shake his. My name is Adolf Fastnack. It's nice to meet you. As you can see, we are fairly abundant in supplies around here. He, we would be happy to trade with you should you be needing anything in particular. Don't need anything really. I feel like something about this isn't right. You politely nod goodbye and head back to the station wagon. You glance back over your shoulder, they don't seem to have followed you. Good group of people. I just feel like I didn't really need anything at this time. You see a pile of zombies feasting on something or someone. Gross. Oh, we're almost to the mines already. Look at that. You discover one of your gas tanks is filled with water. Like I said early in this season, in the series, uh, we're looking on the bright side of things. You can see an explosion in the distance. The mine. Just like the mine that Ryla fell into a while back. What kind of jobs we got? 18 bucks for there's a gang of bandits that has been terrorizing this little settlement. I have not been able to do one of these successfully, but I'm going to try it anyway for an extra couple bucks. I'm going to wait until this guy pops up. Oh, I got one. So maybe that's the way to do it. Take aim at one of them. And wait till he stands up to shoot at him. Oh, they're so quick. Oh, I got shot. Damn it. All right, I need to use a med kit, which I got one from that grave, so that's not too bad. Um, they're selling med kits for $53, which is actually the cheapest we've seen it in a while. Um, so we could sell some food. Ooh, we're actually kind of low on food. Um, how much do we get for ammo? $7 for 20 I don't really want to sell my ammo. Um, let's just not do anything there yet. Let's go scavenge a little bit. Or see what anyone's trading? Nothing. Um, yeah, let's scavenge a little bit. Maybe we can find some money or some food. Right off the bat, we've got a billfold laying here. Ooh, and something, I'm not sure what that is. Um, food. That's a bag of food, and that's a whole cart full. So let's get those. That's a Barney zombie. Slow him down. Shoot him again. Kill him. Kill these guys. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Oh. All right, sweet. So we got the full amount of food in 20 bucks. Um, now we have plenty of food. Let's scavenge one more time just to see if we can pull back another 250, uh, which would be really nice. Because if we can do that, then we'll be good to sell quite a bit of food. Oh, and some scraps would be nice too to be able to fix the car when we need to. So 
Not complaining about picking those up. Oh yeah, more food. Shoot. So we have an escape route if we need to. This isn't looking the best right now. Ah, oh, he got me! Dang it. I'm really kind of wasting some of my life right now. Oop, I don't want to kill anybody. I want to rest for th three hours. I'm not going to use my last med kit, but I'm going to sell some of my food so I can get some more fuel so I know we're going to make it. I have a feeling like the last leg of the trip might the fuel is going to be outrageously expensive too. Um, the car is doing all right. Let's go ahead and repair it. Oh, I've only got I've got quite a bit of scraps, so I'm gonna make sure it gets repaired. So we'll have a higher percentage rate going on right now. And it was successful. Oop! Nope. Don't want that. Well, I accidentally did it anyway. Wow, it was successful, and we only used one scrap, so that's fine then. A decent mistake. Um, no jobs listed. Let's sell some of our food. We'll sell... 150 of it. We'll buy... Two fuel. And... I'd like to buy one more med kit. Let's sell some scraps. I think that would give us enough to buy the med kit. Oh, not quite enough. Uh, sell one more scrap. For the med kit. We'll buy one. And we're done. Let's leave this town. We're headed to Salt Lake City, 228 miles out. Frog has the measles. Alright. Hopefully... Let's just keep an eye on his health for a little bit here. I don't really want to stop. I want to keep moving. Suddenly find yourself surrounded to zombies. Uh, they smell the measles. Right in the head. Headshot. Oops. It says activity is deadly. I would assume that the zombies would uh, come out a little bit more than at that point. Um, if anybody is curious if they should buy this game, I don't think it's too expensive, and it's actually probably one of my favorite games that I've played um, here, especially just for like YouTubing and having fun. It's it's super fun. I even bought it. I bought it on my computer um, for on a Steam sale for Hol or for Halloween, I think. And then it was so much fun that I decided to buy it. Oh, fire in a car destroys 41 of our food. That's okay. But, um, like I was saying, I love this game so much that I bought it for my tablet, actually, so that I can play it on, like, car trips or if I'm ever public transporting to on a train or anything like that. Salt Lake City. Let's check out this map here. Well, let's see... Our car is full. Let's go ahead and rest for four hours, five hours. Maybe that'll make it to where Frog is not um, having the measles anymore. Hopefully he will be healed of that and regain full health. Um, I think we should maybe do another scavenge. Yeah, no longer has the measles. Check that out. And we've got two med kits still. I'll go ahead and use one. The car is 100% perfect. Don't really have any money to buy anything. Let's see if anyone's trading for a muffler. I'm willing to trade one of their muffler for 23 of our ammo. Let's do it. Just in case we have any problems, we're good to go here with stuff. Um, and what can we buy here? Nothing. Can't buy anything. Let's check where we're at. I think we're right here, actually. I think we're on our last leg. Wait for this to go. I wish there was a way to speed this up. Yeah, we're on our last leg here, folks. So we're going to call this the end of the episode. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.